Hey guys, what is up? I'm Stratliff, and uh, I'm going to show you guys how to make a JPEG image uh, PNG file. So basically what that means is the back of the image, the background, is going to be transparent. So you can put it on videos, pictures, thumbnails, whatever you want. You can just put it on there, and uh, it'll, it'll look blend in with whatever you're making. So first you want to go on Google and search uh, Pixlr, P-I-X-L-R. And uh, go to photo editor online, it's pixlr.com. So you just want to go on that. You're going to see this pop up. You can just X that out. I apologize for the uh, all the slow internet. I'm rendering the, um, I don't even know why this is loading. I'm rendering the uh, Slender Let's Play. So that's, I apologize for that. But anyways, you're going to open image. And uh, you're going to want to do more simpler pictures, such as this, or this, or this, or even this. Um, but ones that are like all complicated like this right here I know you can barely see them because you can, you're seeing the whole thing but it's like a lot of lines and stuff and you're, it's gonna be harder to make so you're gonna want to pick something simple I'm just gonna pick these balloons here and what you're gonna want to go to do is go to this uh, wand tool and then just click the background and uh, okay my computer is being stupid. I don't know why I'm making this video while something's rendering, but I, I am. I don't know why. Um, anyways, so you can go and edit the tolerance of this. I think it's like how um, how like sharp it's going to be around your thing. But I mean, I don't really see the difference, honestly. Or I wait. I think if I go and I like bring it all, the tolerance all the way up and I click it again, then it's going to be like better, maybe. I don't know. I'm just gonna bring it down, back to zero. I don't think it matters which one you probably does. Whatever. Anyways, what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to file. No, you're gonna go to edit. I apologize. And you're gonna go to uh, invert selection. Was that selection? Yes, yeah, selection. All right. And it, you're just gonna see what you well want to be selected, which are the balloons. And uh, now what we're gonna go do is uh, go to edit and then copy. And um, that's going to copy it to your clipboard, which uh, it, I, it's somewhere over here, I think. I, I'm not sure. So we can just ec go ahead and X this out and no, don't save. And then X that out, and we're going to go to File, uh, New Image, and then click Create Image from Clipboard and Transparent. And you're going to click OK, and it's going to bring that back. And as you can see, the background is transparent. That's what the checkerboard means. So now what we're going to go to do is uh, go to File and then... Um, save and make sure you can save this to your computer whatever you want Facebook all that good stuff but uh, you save it as whatever name but make sure this is the most important part make sure to save it as a PNG file transparent full quality and that's how you're gonna get the uh, transparent background just click that it's working because my computer's really slow right now it's gonna look like that and it's transparent now so you can just put it on stuff and uh, that's my tutorial on how to make things transparent. Uh, I'm Stratliff, and I'll talk to you guys later.